Good morning from Brady's apartment. Say hi, Brady. Ooh, hello. What are we doing today? We're going to a horse race. We're going to a horse race, and that means starting off the morning with protein pancakes. These are from Trader Joe's. I think they're supposed to be like Kodiak cakes, but I bought them this week. We put in some Ghirardelli chocolate chips, but this is how the morning is starting off. And then tomorrow we are going to the Miami Dolphins and New York Jets football game as a Christmas present for Brady from his family. And we're so excited for that. So welcome to this weekend in our lives and we're gonna do some fun things in South Florida and bring you along. I took a shower this morning because my hair was disgusting but I need to air wrap it with the Dyson and then figure out what I'm wearing today. Some of these people at this horse race are bougie and I need to look the part and feel like I'm okay there. We're gonna pull off these pancakes for Brady. One of Brady's bosses has two horses racing today so he invited us to come on down and come watch the race and we're like okay yeah we think we're only gonna stay for one but that is awesome. We've gone before to see his horse race and and he just is really cool. Your pancakes, sir. Thank you. Wow. Wow. You probably need some syrup, don't you? I eat my pancakes without syrup, so I'm never really used to that. Anyway, I'm going to start to get ready for the day. I really want to try this new protein bar I got, which is why I didn't make myself pancakes, but Lord knows I'll probably have a bite of Brady's. But I do want to try this one from Trader Joe's. It's like a chocolate PB&J. I don't really know, but that, and I'm going to crack open a Celsius get my hair done, get my makeup done, and we're gonna go to the horse race today and football game tomorrow, and you guys are coming along on a weekend in our lives. Oh my back will be. Ooh, real hot. They definitely have a little bit of a different texture than like the Pearl Mill House, whatever, old Aunt Jemima brand, but they've got whole grains and protein, but the chocolate chips, Ghirardelli chocolate chips are the only way to go. My mom actually got those for us for a different pancake mold, but we didn't feel like doing the pancake mold this morning, so how are they? Pretty good. Okay, sounds good. Now the question is, is where's my air wrap? This is the bathroom that I like to call my bathroom in this apartment because it's the half bath in the apartment and I'm resting you guys on my Stanley Cup just to do a quick little taste test of this Anna bar. It's called Milk Chocolate PB and Belly. I don't know. This is like a complete meal. I've never had one of these before. We saw it at Trader Joe's and they thought I would try it out. They also had another flavor, but I forget what it was. This is so small. How could you expect me to think that this is a whole meal? No way. It's not bad, but it's not great. Mm -mm. Mm. I think I'll be eating something else. Anyway, I'm going to get ready, do my hair, and just air wrap it really quick. Put the top part of my hair up in a claw clip, and I'm gonna focus on the down area. I am gonna use the wrap portion, even though it's so humid here in Florida. There's literally no point, because my hair's gonna fall flat, and you'll see that in a sec, but I do wanna do it, because I feel like it gives me more volume than any of the other attachments that I have. So that's what I'm gonna do to this pretty much almost dry hair, like pretty much getting getting there dry. Take it all in because this is my hair fresh and done, no product sprayed in it or anything and it will not stay this way. It's just gonna fall so flat. I mean, really, there's just no way around it but you know what? I'm gonna treat myself to a Celsius and do my makeup and then we're gonna get ready to go. Run some errands before we go to the horse race. I'm gonna go for a tropical vibe today. I think that this sounds good. And get my makeup bag and just do a little bit of something because Got nothing. Okay, so I just did my makeup. I filmed one of those like get ready with me's on TikTok. It felt so awkward, but honestly, I can see why people like doing it because it was fun. Even though I'm not very good at makeup, I still need to use a Q-tip to get off this mascara, but this is pretty much what I'm doing. I'm gonna add something to my lips once I figure out what I'm wearing. Gonna crack open my Celsius finally because I didn't do that before. <sighs> 10:20. I aim to leave here at 10:30, so let's hope I can pick an outfit in 10 minutes. I have just no idea. I have like six different options, so let's go pick an outfit. Okay, so here's what I ended up picking. I already actually had this dress at Brady's apartment, which is the crazy part. I just didn't love anything else. Hi, Brady. He's waiting for me. I'm taking too long. But this white and pink dress is from Zara. I think it is so cute. I bought it this summer, so I don't know if it's still available. And then these shoes are from Dolce Vita. They're just little teeny, 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 tiny block heels, sandals, super comfy. And then I'm going to grab a purse out of the car. I've also got these earrings on, which are from Lily Plitzer. And then my compass necklace that my mom got us. But this is the fit. Where's your fit from? Nike. I think these are bird dog shorts. Okay. Pita Mala. Pita Mala. That's it. No earrings? No jewelry? No earrings. <laughs> Nothing. And we're going to go see the horsies. Woo I just need to grab something to put on my lips in the car once I finish my Celsius. 
And I want to grab a purse out of my car because Brady is going to drive. I'm the passenger princess. And we are going to head off first to Nordstrom Rack to do a return from Christmas. Sort of to help my mom out and we then one for... What? We need gas. And we need gas. Oh my gosh, I'm going to introduce Brady to the Upside app to get gas in the car. Oh man. Found the cap. But anyways, you guys know that I talk about Upside all the time. So we'll tell Brady how that all works in the car ride over and while we get some gas and some cash back on our gas. First little stop of the day, Nordstrom Rack, returning some Christmas gifts. We only had until like a certain day in January to get this all done. So we're doing it today. You gonna get some clothes? Yeah. Yeah, baby. What do we think about these earrings? I think these are so fun and they're $10. Yeah, how are you? Nordstrom Rack was a success. Brady got two new shirts. We got some tweezers and I got a pair of earrings. Perfect. Perfect. And we were only in there for 15 minutes. No, we were not. 10 Probably minutes. We were a little longer than that. It's 11, 22, 20 minutes. 20 minutes. 20 minutes, that's, that's it. That is a win, especially for Brady. So I think now we're going to get some gas and then head down to horse racing track. We might go there a little bit early to get pictures of mojitos, which I'm a-okay with. What are you doing, Brady? Getting the Upside app. He hasn't downloaded the Upside app yet, usually because we probably use it on my phone, but today he's gonna get it so that we can show you how we're using the Upside app to get our cash back for gas today. Since we drive a lot and things can get really expensive, I love to use the Upside app to get my gas. It is cash back on something that you are using every Every single day and Brady is finally getting introduced to Upside. So Brady just downloaded it and used my promo code Gracie and that's gonna give him an extra 25 cents back per gallon that he gets today on his gas. So you guys, you know that you can use that code as well. Download the free Upside app from the App Store and use the code Gracie. That gets you that 25 cents back on every gallon, your first tank of gas. So we are going to pick a gas station and get some cash back. It's so simple. You just put the card that you're going to be using at the gas station on your app click on whatever gas station you're going to go to and you don't have to do a thing. You will automatically get that cash back into your Upside app. And all you have to do is you can cash out to your PayPal, you can cash out to gift cards like Amazon or other online retailers. It is super simple. So we are going to pick a gas station that has the best cash back offer and go get some gas. Plus the big thing is Upside does not sell your information to third parties. They know that it's safe and secure with them. So don't worry about putting any of your card information in on that app. Like I said, you guys can download the app for free use my promo code and on your first tank of gas you can get 25 cents back on each gallon Ooh. Ooh. smells like savings My camera died on the way over here, so the phone it is. We are at Gulfstream Park. We just parked. There's the Carousel Club, but I think we're gonna go into the owner's circle with the horse and Brady's boss before the race. So that's where we're headed right now. And I have to go to the bathroom. So I was like, that is an absolute mess. That is the first. But we are here. I'm gonna show you around, bring you everywhere, and we're gonna watch a little horses race. <coughs> I can't believe Ryan didn't call me yet. He's in trouble now. It's a good album. I'm not This is the owner's circle. We're going to be standing right over here. and the race is about to start no, and Joe's horse is number three. Oh, three's not favorite in it. Where's the other race? Yeah. Well, we're down on the track. We're rooting for number three. The odds are three, which is pretty good. We don't want him to be the favorite, but close to the favorite. And we're gonna watch the race. Also, the sweetest lady just complimented my dress. I was like, thank you, Prague, sir. You need Prague over here. Are you excited? Very. We're gonna win? Oh, yeah. Okay. Third place. Third place. It's pretty good. It's the horse's first race ever. So, you're very happy about it. 
We're in the Carousel Club, and you guys, this is the bar. It's awesome. I love it here. And then they've got some cornhole, different activities. Another bar over here, and then Brady and I just ordered tacos, but they also have burgers and pizza. So it's just like a cute little area. Right now there are kids in here, which last time we came they checked our IDs, but this is what it looks like. So cute. Thinking we might stay in the area for dinner. Or even watch the next race. Or even watch the next race and then head to dinner. I mean, it's not dinner time, it's like three something, but... Just trying to think ahead. Brady wants to be back home, ready for the 8-15 game. Titans, but, Jaguars. Yeah. Winner to the playoffs. Yeah. So we got to at least be back for that. But otherwise, we've got no plans. We're just kind of walking around all the little shops around here. Okie dokie. Decision has been made. We're back in the truck. We're heading back up to the apartment. And we made a reservation at 60 Vines. We were able to get a 7-15, which was not available yesterday when we looked. And we're going to get some dinner at 60 Vines later today. It's only 4 o'clock. So we're just gonna head back home, chill for a little bit, and what might we do before we go to dinner? We're gonna go to the mall. Lululemon specific. <laughs> so we have some like returns, exchanges, stuff we wanna look at. We both have gift cards, so we're just gonna figure out what we're gonna do, but that's the plan. It's about 45 minutes back to the apartment, and then I'm gonna grab a new camera battery, so I'm not still on my phone. <laughs> Well, hello there. It is now six o'clock, you guys. I literally napped almost the whole ride home. I felt so bad for Brady. I was like, that's what I get for being a passenger princess. And then we came back and watched some football. And then I took just a tiny body shower because I was a little stinky. And instead of putting back on my dress, I put on this two-piece set from Zara that I'm literally obsessed with. Brady also changed because he wanted to match me. He put on a little pink with some tan. And this is my set. Probably sold out because I bought it this past spring. But it's these pants and this crop top these little jewel pieces. I wish our mall had a Zara so bad because I really do love Zara, but I did buy these online. It's kind of how it works. I'm wearing flat sandals right now, but I brought heels for our reservation. Wow, you look really tall next to me right now. <laughs> Whoa! Hello? <laughs> anyway, we are going to head to shop at the mall a little bit before we go. I have a Lululemon exchange. We have some gift cards. So we're going to go see if we can spend those before heading off to dinner. Coming to the Boca Mall is always such a weird thing for me because I worked here in high school at the Lily Blitzer here and I would come here a lot. So now it's very crazy that we're just back here because you live here. Actually, I really do love this mall, but this is where we're going to Lululemon and then anything else we might have time for. We still have an hour until our reservation and it's probably five minutes away from yeah. here. I mean, getting into the car will count at 10. But uh, yeah, we got a little bit of time to look around. Y'all know I could spend a whole day in this mall. So we're just gonna go see what, what goodies we can find. Okay, so I grabbed these two because I thought that they could be cute together. And you can't tell in this exact lighting, but they're two different colors. I thought they were the same. They look the same, but on and on top of each other, this is a different blue than this. But these shorts, y'all? Oh my gosh, these are like four inch cozy shorts. I don't know what these are called. The Loungeville HR short. I think I need these. They also come in gray. I think these are so cute, but tops and out. We are here walking into 60 Vines. Only took us 10 minutes to find a parking spot, but the phone is going away because we decided we were having a phoneless dinner. Right. Phones are away. We're not looking at them at all. So, have a great night. Let's go sushi. Okay, I know I said no phones, but our food looks so good. I got like a pesto chicken pasta. Brady got a spicy sausage pizza. But now the phone's going back away. Ah. We're home from dinner. It was delicious, and Brady has immediately got my spot on the couch. And he's going to turn on the football game, whereas I claimed the bedroom because now there's a TV in here, and I'm going to turn on my Netflix show. I've been watching season two of Ginny and Georgia. I for, kind of forgot about that show. And then I got a notification from Netflix that there was a season two out. I was like, oh, I totally forgot. Now I'm like binging it. So we're gonna do our own separate little things just for a little bit. I'm gonna get in some PJs and some comfy clothes, take off my makeup, that kind of stuff. It's 8.35. This is a very lit Saturday night. <laughs> also just what I like to do. So I'm gonna put on some PJs and get in the bed, honestly. Hey. Wake up everybody, it's game day! Woo! Except it's not Alabama game day. It's my first NFL game. And we are going down to the Hard Rock Stadium in Miami to support the Dolphins! 
didn't see him in Dolphin's colors, but I also have a hat. I just haven't decided which one yet that I borrowed from my neighbor Jill. Thanks, Jill. This is the fit. I'll show you really quick. I actually was going to wear this on our cruise, and I never did. This orange top is from a store, I think called the New Yorker or something like that in Europe. So I have no idea, but I'm sure you can find something very similar on Amazon. This skirt is from Shein, but like my freshman year of college, I think. So a very long time. Socks are linked on my storefront, and then these shoes are from Gucci. And I just think it all goes so well together. And then I'll pick either this hat, which is adorable, or this hat. I felt like this had more teal in it. So we'll see. I've got my clear bag. I also believe this is from Amazon. My wallet, lip gloss, my sunglasses. Brady's wearing his jersey. For Jalen Waddle. Let's go. The white is the home jersey, and this is a home game. And we're gonna go today to the game. And I think we're gonna stop at Starbucks on the way there for some food slash drink. I grabbed a Celsius, but we're getting ready to go. I have two hats I'm deciding between. This is the first one, very teal. This is Miami, but it's orange, so it like goes. Or this one, which Brady really likes. Very floral Hawaiian with the dolphin, but I felt like it was too much white. Especially with my white shoes. So we're gonna decide on the ride over. I don't like wearing hats in the car. So I'm gonna decide a little bit later, but we are getting on our way to go see the dolphins play. There we go. Uh -huh. The rest of the vlog's gonna be on the phone. Brady's gonna help me take pictures so I can figure out which one, just very quickly with my outfit I'm gonna wear. Checking the rest of our Celsius, and we're gonna get on the way. I try to make friends with people to let us tailgate with, with them. Alabama yeah, we're gonna see if we find some Alabama fans, so stay tuned. This tailgating is out of control. Like, we're with how many speakers? Seven at one place? Like, not regular speakers, like no. concert level. It was so loud, I should have filmed it, but we got these claws at Walmart, so we're walking around with them in little plastic bags. Oh my god. Everybody. Well, our weekending is over and I am getting ready to start off this fresh new week with a new mindset and so much stuff going on right now. Thank you guys so much for watching this weekend in my life. I hope that it was so fun. We had two really fun filled days. I couldn't believe it because half the time we're like, what did we do? And this weekend we had things to do on both days, which was just really exciting. And the horse race was totally free. I mean, obviously we had to pay for like the mojitos and stuff, but like going to the horse race is free. So that was like a nice free activity to have on a Saturday. So if you're local to South Florida, you guys should totally check check it out one day. I love you guys so much. Let me know what other videos you want to see in the comments down below and I will see you soon. Bye!